Well, here I am out on my travels again. It is time to do the secrets of Southern Railway, and we are here at Weddell Station. Now, at Weddell, there is like a curve of tracks going to the south side of the station. The tracks on the right lead to like Wygate and to um, Wedding and to the west. Straight ahead is like right down to the south coast, Southampton and everywhere, and to the further left, going east is to Gatwick Airport and to the Brighton Main Line. Anyway, you can see all the curves on the track. Moving on, and we're going to show you around the station. So there's Weddell Station with its name itself, and you can clearly see the Southern sign on there. Now, it isn't just called Southern. We call it Southern Railway, like they used to in the olden days, where the steam trains used to exist. Now, we're walking down the station here, and we're just showing you around. Yeah, we're just showing you around the train station because it's very interesting. So we're like on the main line there. If you look further down, that's all the main line to London. And it's a very busy line. It's a very busy line because it's operated by Southern Railway. But most services from this platform here, this little platform one, is mostly operated by First Great Western. For the services that go to Wedding, to Gatwick Airport and stations all between there. Now we're going to show you all around the station, around the other way. I like these southern roundel posters that look all really nice around the staircase and the stairsway. I like the idea of that. Looks really good, look. That's what I mean by Southern Railway. It's called Southern Railway. It's got their website logo on the poster. Here we are, we've got the waiting room straight ahead of me with some information in where to give out night like, timetables and whatever. Moving on, and we're going to show you around the station. So we're going down a flight of stairs. Going to find the secrets of Weddell Station. Now as you come down the stairs, it's just an open subway. There's like posters on the wall. There's a passenger lift straight ahead in front of you, which takes you down to the lower level of the station near the bus interchange. Oh, and there's the sign here. It says buses on there on one sign, and then the other sign, it says way out. Now there's two way outs of this station. There's one way out, which is pointing ahead of me here to the ticket barriers, and there's an alternative way out without the ticket barriers, which is where we're gonna go to. They've got an announcement information board here, which show you around the rest of the station. Now platforms one and two is up here, and the other platforms will be further down, basically. They're just showing you around. Oh, if you want a free magazine, you just pick one of these up, called the Weald and Times. The lifestyle magazine of Sawi, whatever that means. Anyway, moving on, we're going this way round. There's another lift here, which goes up to platform three for wheelchair access and push chairs and everything else. So we're just still showing you around the station. We're going up another flight of stairs. The secrets of Southern Railway. And there's a nice poster here, look. The big ticket. I like the idea of that. Changes to train times. I'm just having a good look at this because it looks very interesting. Oh, except for the wet floor sign, of course. So now we're going up another flight of stairs. And that's where the other way out is, around this way here. That's another secret for Red Hill Station. All we do now is we wait for the other train to pull into the station and we'll show you what the southern train looks like. 
vehicle we just stood here where they were at the minute. There's the other end of the platform. Right over there, I was stood on the end at that station sign minutes ago. But it's still showing you around the station. You can still see all the curves on the tracks. You can look straight ahead here, you can still see the London Main Line. A lot of train services from here go to London Bridge and services to London Victoria. And London isn't far from here, it's only about 20 miles away. There's the Red Hill Station with the sign on. So this is the secrets of Southern Railway. It looks like it's a long train coming down the platform, so I've got to move back a bit to get the whole train. This is a very good documentary so far, which I am sounding like Jeff Marshall a bit, who just did all the tube lines in London, but this is for Southern Railway. Except for the pigeon flying at us. Oh, of course, another pigeon. Just ignore the pigeons because the train is now coming into the station. And it's a Southern Class 377 Southern Railway. So here's 377446. The train will be filmed in this clip. As you can see, the Class 377 Letro Stars are really nice, reliable trains. We will show you how the train would depart in a second. So this is the secrets of Southern Railway. There's 377446. And that's what a Southern Class 377 looks like. This will be something else as well. 377 whatever. Here we go, it's 377462 and it's going to Horsham, Southern Railway. Anyway, we're back into the documentary and we're still showing you around the west of the station. Platform 3 for the 1300 hours southern service to Southampton Central. And it's like a little waiting booth there, whatever that is. There's an alternative way out, which we will show you. Now this is the alternative way out of Weddell Station. This is like the secrets of Weddell Station. The old notice board there. Oh, and there's a sign saying way in. There's a ticket machine there, tickets for services and travelling on the trains. And there we are outside Weddell Station. Now this is another entrance outside the station, but this is the very quiet entrance. And it looks really nice indeed. And there's a load of posters outside the station saying information on the board with a little waiting room. And it says, Welcome to Edil, which I really like to look at. And there you have it, the secrets of Southern Railway at Redhill Station. And I hope you enjoyed this video clip, and it will be on YouTube.